I have a total mess in here. So what I'm doing is making room, oh my gosh, making room for the, the bike in the back. And I had a full size bed rail. So I put in a twin and made room in the back. So I'll be able to fit the bike back there. Now, and what I've done is secured the bed rail with um, zip ties, as many as I can put in there. And each zip tie is supposed to hold 300 pounds or something like that, so. So that's what I'm doing. Now I'll show you when I'm done. Look at the big mess I have in there. Oh, the, bed, the twin bed is up, secured. The big refrigerator is out, and I'm going to take that to storage. There's a few things I need to do. And tomorrow I think I'll video a little bit more of what I'm doing. Good morning, everyone. <clears throat> I already started this morning. I forgot to turn on the, the camera. But it's just so hectic. I don't have time to, like, film, so I'm just going to show you what I've done. I've taken out the refrigerator case and that refrigerator. I'm going to use the small one just for, I don't need that much refrigerator space for this small trip. And there's just like a mess everywhere. I've got to sort it out and put it where I want it. All right, and then I'll just come back and look at this storage. Oh my goodness. And then I'll just come back and show you what I've accomplished maybe halfway through. Okay. See you later. I'm back. So I'm done. All I need to do is try putting the bike in the back. But I've already taken out everything that I don't use or don't want in here. This I brought in. It's like a little extra storage and stool, bring in my ladder, the TV tray, and then this tray can act as a little table too, like when I'm charging my batteries from the window, I put my battery right there while it's still running my refrigerator. And this is the little refrigerator I brought in, the Alpha Cool. And yeah, I'm taking that to put outside, just a little decoration for outside. And I put in this, I put this back in. Very lightweight drawers. I took the bottom one out and put my garbage can in there. Here's my stool because my bed is way higher. And I've got my blue eddy down there. And these are little storage, uh, well actually they're pet carriers, but I use them for storage, toilet paper, tissues, paper plates, stuff like that. And then this is the bathroom area. I set it back up as a bathroom. Just a good old bucket. And then there's the horse pellets, bags, um, gel pads, whatever they're called. They turn urine into gel. I like this because it's, a, it's somewhere to sit down instead of on the bed. 
So I just put my water back here. Because it's hidden, tucked away, and I won't fall. There's that. And let me see. Yep, there's the bed. And this jackery runs my fan. So I have that right here. I wish I could have a little stand back there, something where this can stay secured. But I haven't come up with anything yet. So let me show you the back where I'm going to put the bike. With the bed up like that, I have way more storage. Just have this tucked in there. And there's the back of everything. Those right there, those are tools, zip ties, extension, butane, fire extinguisher, my extension cord. And this is just extra paper. My Blue Eddy charger solar panel that does not charge my blue eddy i need to have two so either i'm going to purchase another one or get a 400 watt foldable solar panel because i just haven't put the solar on the top yet i'm hoping that when i go to the rtr maybe i'll Maybe someone will put them in for me. So there you go. And the bike should sit right here. Fingers crossed. And I'm thinking I could lift it up here. All I would do is lift up the front handlebar area first and put it up here and then grab the back and put the back just put one in one end in at a time okay I'm already burnt out my big refrigerator my microwave and then all my stickers are right here. Shucks. Guess I'll get some new ones. All right. Talk to you later.